Hello. We're already a hot mess. Hello, everybody. Hello. Um, Finally, happy hour. Yeah. Finally. We've been busy yeah. since we've been here, so we haven't had that. There we are. How's it going, guys? Here. Hi, guys. So. We got a whole bunch of you guys in the house already. So many people already here. Yeah. What are we doing today? We're doing, what do you think we're doing? We're doing crafting we're doing, with cocktails. Okay, cocktails, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> crafting with cocktails. All right. But first, we're going to tell them about the craft, so yeah, we can talk so... about what we're going to do. Then we'll craft the cocktail. That way, if anybody wants to have some work to cut out to join us, you can. Yes. So We're glad you guys are all here. We're going to switch over here. As you go to MelodyLaneInspired.com. If you are a supporter, click on Supporter Projects. You type in the handy dandy password. That's Blue's Clues. <laughs> <laughs> and then you scroll down, you type in cocktail. So we thought since we were crafting a cocktail, we would do a cocktail related card. So this is going to be our happy hour shaker card. And there's no photo yet because we haven't made it yet. We literally just got done cutting it 20 minutes ago. Yep. You hit open. And then it brings you here. Which is here. And I'm going to go ahead and show you guys some things in this. That's a shaker card. Loading, loading, loading. Do, 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 do. You did it to that song. Didn't you? <laughs> do, 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 raw high. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right. So, this, uh, you take the toilet seat covers off. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, acetate. This gray piece here is acetate. Um, I feel like this is on here, right? Oh, no, no. So, this is the foam. Uh -huh. That's a craft foam. No, yeah. So, this. This piece is your bottom layer. And there's a little cut underneath birthday that this piece will go up and behind. So you would glue this part to the back of the birthday. So it's sit like so. And then that score line is how you lift up the toilet seat. Um, this white piece here, or gray piece, is um, foam. We did foam. Yeah, if you, if you don't have foam, just duplicate this a few times. Maybe do craft board or card sock just to give it some 3 d ness in there. Here's your acetate that would go on top of that. And then this is to cover up the glue marks from the acetate. And that's your trim piece. And then underneath it says every hour is happy hour. <coughs> and, yeah, so here, you know, this is separate, so this will glue onto this. So, this piece, if, if you guys were trying to uh, open it earlier, there were some issues. It was because we had it set to this piece, which is uh, foil. So, if you want to do foil, it's hidden in the layers panel. Otherwise, it's right here. Uh, it's probably blocked up, so open the door. And then... It's hidden? It's, it's in the door. It's so, hidden. look at the edge of the door. There's a little spot that you pull down. Um. <laughs> Hold on, people. We're having a problem with ice. So, did you find it? No. So, if you're looking at the door, look at the edge of the door. There's a little handle. Right here? Yeah. Okay. Pull that handle. That is a secret ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So she's getting ice, so that's why it's so noisy. <laughs> um, so yeah, we cut out all our colors in this. You can do whatever you want. And for the umbrella, we actually used craft board because it's a little bit thicker material. So then it doesn't... Hopefully, doesn't like try to lay down on us. All right. All right. So we got that. Now we're just waiting on Holly. 
Birthday card, it could be a happy retirement card. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's your retirement every hour is happy hour. It could be like, hey, let's go have some drinks, and here's my invitation for you. Oh, I need to. Boop, boop, boop. Handy dandy. Painted. Uh, TV tray. So we're working on. Oh, now it's showing on this. Okay. <laughs> now I'm gonna fix it. Oh, we're cracking up about the thing. So we're gonna make two different drinks today. One is gonna be I call it Rainbow Sprite, um, and it's gonna be a rainbow. And then we're gonna use coconut rum for that. You can use Malibu. I prefer. Well, we'll go through that. Yeah. Home cameras are ideal because we would have another camera. Yeah, yeah. We, like I said, I lost one of the cameras um, in Las Vegas, I believe. So. These are not the ideal camera angles. <laughs> Does anybody else have a cocktail and tell me you don't have to drink? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to say, say that whole spiel? Because I'm, yeah, that obviously, words. nobody has to drink with us. You don't have to drink alcohol. Some of these drinks you can even make virgin. There's a way to yeah. make the cock, or the rainbow one even. But um, if you want to drink, obviously drink responsible. Cricket is not related in this video in any way. This was, yeah. Don't blame them for shenanigans. Shenanigans. <laughs> Shenanigans. Shenanigans. Uh, someone's having blackberry wine. Oh, delicious. Um. Anything with the fruit? I don't really like the taste of alcohol, so. Surely we, we might we might have to do a coffee one soon. Yeah. She wants to have spiked coffee. Oh, we found so. something yesterday when we went to get our. Liquor. Or, yeah. Our liquor store. <laughs> yeah. They have taste testings. Oh, someone has some moonshine, some cream butter pecan from oh, Sugarlands. Ooh, I haven't had that one, but I do love the butter pecan one. This is so, first I just gotta say, this is so weird. Rum and Coke, Jameson. Sit down and Bloody do this. Mary. Elderberry oh. wine. We got all, all kinds. Right. Excellent, guys. Apple whiskey. Nice. It really is happy hour. So at home, I have a bar. So when I do this at home, I can be standing at a bar. It's so weird. I'm like, I've never sat down and made a drink. Like, at who least, sits down and makes drinks? This camera angle is not not a fan. I'm not a fan. No, <laughs> like, I know. I know. Why do you think I changed my shirt and put it on a hoodie? Because I'm like, that is not. I need anyway, so what we're making do now, we'll have different camera angles. When we go back, Alex is going to help get me yeah. set up. Um. We'll craft an actual bar then. Yeah. So, ooh, blackberry moonshine margarita, mama cat. That sounds phenomenal. Care Bears, I know. I love the Care Bears. They're life changing, literally. They helped my daughter when she was a teenager through depression. I showed yep. the Care Bears. It changed her life. Kimberly has hard Mountain Dew. I actually just tried that a couple days ago. It's really good. Um, margarita, apple pie moonshine. Vodka, orange juice, with pina colada. This is the weirdest setup I've ever had in my life to make a drink. I don't even know what <laughs> to do with myself. A little TV table. <laughs> a little TV table. All right. So first, I'm just putting ice in the glass, guys, and then we're gonna. I'm gonna. I always want to chill the liquor. Um, I use Captain Morgan coconut rum. It's my favorite. Malibu is milder, um, more coconut flavor. But when you're doing like a mixed drink, this has more alcohol. It's like 35%, where Malibu is 22%, and you're adding lots of juices. So. It's kind of like more for your money type of thing. It is more for your money. It's cheaper too. <laughs> oh, where's the little thingy? I don't really measure I like that. Do I really have to measure like that? No. Okay, so you can get the little shot glass thingy, pour it in. I don't measure like that. You could just use the thing in there. Sure, let's use that. You know, I did this earlier and I poured it into a shot because I don't measure at home. I just, you know. <laughs> for pour. that one that I drank? Yeah, and I was like, that's, that." I poured the one shot thing and I'm like, that? That's all that's supposed to go in there? That doesn't even make sense. I'm gonna do two caps of this. So two caps of coconut rum. Where's the other glass? Oh, <laughs> yeah. The one that. <laughs> yep. 
I don't even know what to do with this to get it out of the way here. So I just put that in there and then I'm going to add my pineapple juice. That way it'll chill it. You don't have to. I mean, you can put this on ice too. Which Make I sure not do. to shake it without the other cap on there. <laughs> <That's not important. laughs> Ooh, French vanilla wine. Hey, we have a birthday in the house. Happy birthday, Twyla. Happy birthday. Well, this is tomorrow. a fun way to spend. Oh, tomorrow. Well, hopefully this is a good way to start off your birthday. So anyway, I just have coconut rum, pineapple juice in here, and I just want to mix it. I don't know what all you can see in them. <laughs> All I'm gonna do is pour this in here. This is not a good. This is a new shaker. We've never used it, so we just found out. It's hard to find a good shaker, is it not? Yeah. A lot of them don't come off. The lid doesn't come off, and then you're just stuck. Yeah. With a mess. So I'm gonna fill this almost all the way up. Remember, this is just pineapple and coconut rum. You can add simple sugar or simple syrup. Which I have right here. Yeah. You can just add, you, you liked it in the other one, didn't you? Oh, that's in there? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I just need to fill it up some more, so I'm just going to go in with the pineapple. Oh, by the way, guys, not a bartender. Never been a bartender. <laughs> I just make fun drinks at home. I like to make some on fire. Whatever. Why be ordinary when you can be extraordinary? <laughs> I add a little simple syrup to it. That's just going to sweeten it a little bit. Just a dabble do ya of that. And then we're going to make this rainbow. So to get the red, you are going to pour in the grenadine slowly. Make sure you do it slowly because you don't want it to mix all the way. You can if you have a stirring spoon or you can take a spoon, turn it over backwards and run it down it um, also. But you just want it to go in kind of slow so it doesn't mix everything up. My phone's going off somewhere. Over, but... um, someone's saying that we're buffering. That's not good. I'll try... Hold on. I need a paper towel is what I need. Yeah, it's buffering. Oh. Oh, it's in my pocket. It shouldn't be because we have green. You got it? Are we yeah. good? Yeah. All right, we're back, guys. So I put some grenadine in, and you can see it's kind of going like sunset color now. So all we have to do is add our blue, which, oh, like that, <laughs> like that. It's problem solving, Alex. It's probably solved. This is the weirdest drink thing I've ever done. All right. So then we're going to put our blue curacao. <laughs> if anyone knows what that's from, please leave it in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, and he's, he's famous for making drinks. He always says, blue curacao. So we were in the store and I said it, and they're like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> All right, we're good now. Sound is a mess. Can you hear us? Lynn said the sound is a mess. All right, so blue curacao, we're going to pour this in here. we got to pour this really slowly because the point of this is we want it to float on the top. So if we pour it in hard, it's just going to go ahead and mix everything and you're going to have a mess. So I just put it in here and I'm just going to pour it slowly onto the top. Like I said, you can just use a spoon flipped upside down. Why is this pouring? Oh, don't, don't, don't. Why is this pouring? I got to stand up to do this. I can't do this sitting down. Nobody does it like that. Hey, when it sticks to the bottle, it's the worst thing ever. I can't even see from this angle. This is bizarre. This is. Why is it all going in one? Just turn it around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I don't want to. Nobody makes a drink at this angle. I made one earlier and it was perfect. Yeah, I thought we were showing it. <laughs> That's why. I know, Alex didn't drink it. I did. All right. Five minutes before the video. <laughs> All right. All right. So you got, where are we at? Where are we at? So look over see, here. Don't look at that one. I know. It's very difficult because it's oh. all backwards. So we made this rainbow drink here. It's like red, yellow, goes to blue. You don't want to stir it too much. It will settle some. But I always, <laughs> yes, I brought these from home. I have these straws at home because, you know, when you put umbrellas in, they always fall in. 
But these are an umbrella on a straw. So it literally just makes you feel like you're on vacation. And then you can just take a little pineapple garnish here. Put it on the side. Does Captain Morgan coconut rum have less coconut flavor than Malibu? It does. It's because it's stronger. Uh, it, there's more alcohol. So obviously it's not, it tastes a little stronger. So you can do Malibu too. Malibu or Captain Morgan. I would stay away from the other ones. They're like harsher. So here is, I forgot the Sprite, but I call it Rainbow Sprite because I'm an 80s baby. You can tell by the Care Bears. I love the Care Bears. I love Rainbow Bright. So like I said, like be bold. Not old, right know. Alex? Not old. So cheers everyone. Oh it is. It's really delicious. And doesn't it just make you happy? Just the color of it makes me happy. You can, um, and it's very tasty too, isn't it, Alex? Yeah. It's, it's very good. tasty. You don't taste alcohol in it. So that makes the best kind of drinks, in my opinion. Uh, but you can make it without alcohol. They do sell Blur Curse, though. That's just a syrup. It blur. doesn't have liquor. What I call it? Blur Curse. Blur Curse. Blur Curse. They do sell one that doesn't have liquor in it. So it's just a syrup. So you could make it with just pineapple juice, grenadine, and blue syrup. So, and then you can have a rainbow colored drink that anybody can drink. So cheers, everyone. Cheers. Passing that to you, Alex. <laughs> Entertain with your drink. Dazzle them. Well, I, I have to empty this to make the next one. Oh, I got to oh. get the... Well, should I start to put a piece together? You can't or just, you know, chat with them while they drink. And see. <laughs> I hate this camera angle. It's the worst. Yeah. <laughs> it really is the worst camera angle. Is Toby in there? Uh, I don't know. If he is, he's just watching. He's not saying that. This is Mindy's oldest daughter was born in the 80s and she had Care Bears. Yes. Did you guys all have a good day today? It doesn't taste like there's alcohol in it, but there is, but it doesn't taste like it. I'd probably like it. Oh my god. Okay. You, you breaking stuff? Well, I might need your help. I need Tom. Oh, oh, that. Yeah. <laughs> you should bring that over here. That should be fun. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Is it broken up? No, it's, it's a giant thing. We just gotta get a... <laughs> no, the, the camera is purposely this way to show the table for the drinks. I told him to go back. Yeah, we'll, we'll push the camera back up. Oh, paper towels are really important too. Yeah. All right. For our next cocktail, if you like key lime pie, even if you don't, because my husband hates key lime pie, but he absolutely loves this drink. And it's super simple. It's two ingredients. And it tastes... I haven't had it, so I don't know. Where am I supposed to be? Oh. This, this one. Delayed. Gotcha. This one, that one, <laughs> that's the light. That's what everyone else is seeing. Okay. So I have that up to see if we're blurry at any time. <laughs> you dropped a straw. I don't need it. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> All right. All we need for this next drink, I'm gonna chill it. And these are the only two ingredients you need. And I tell you, it tastes just like key lime pie. Alex hasn't drank this. Not yet. And he loves key lime pie. I do. So I'm really hoping. But all you need is whipped cream vodka. Um, there's cake vodka too. You can use cake vodka. Shirley likes key lime. <laughs> Candle said watching us has made her day. Good, I'm glad. That was good. I'm a hot mess right now. Like I said, this is our first time and our camera angles aren't what we want. We would have yeah. other cameras. So we're yeah, just going with this it. This is a test run for this. Yeah, you guys are like our guinea pigs for this. Yeah. So, um, whipped cream vodka. I just took your smear off. It's cheap. It's better than like the UV and all that. And then you mix it with Simply Limeade. This is the same brand that makes Simply Lemonade, but you get it in the lime. So, all you're going to do is... Hey, remember when we went to Publix and you said you wanted to get a lime? I got them! Oh, you did? 
Yeah, I don't want to let him use it. Oh, second, you went. I I you did. went into Publix. I did not. Yeah, that's so right. I did. I was gonna pour some in. You can measure if you want. <laughs> <laughs> that's not what we do. <laughs> that's not how we do. I do when I do the ice. I do about fifty-fifty because you got the ice in there, and then I got the liquor, and then I'm gonna add the key lime. You're gonna have to help me with this part. Yeah. Did you get tongues? I mean, I got like. <laughs> you got an ice cream scoop. <laughs> There's not tongs. I couldn't find tongs. There, there, there's two of them. Next... I grabbed an ice cream scoop, guys. It's, I'm like. It's in a bu It's in a bucket. They're a little cup. Okay. So this drink, I was gonna call it like swamp juice originally. You guys will see why. Yeah, there's measurements on that cup. Yes. Yeah, there is measurements. When you measure this, it's just. It's almost 50-50. Just do a little bit less of the whipped cream vodka than the limeade. I never really measure any. If you drink it and it needs a little more, you add a little more. Um, the liquor with the limeade, Mindy, is just whipped cream vodka. We use Smirnoff. That's what I always go go with. Thanks, Donna, for the, about the Care Bear shirt. I know I was so happy when I seen they had this. I was like, oh, Care Bear shirt, you're, you're coming home with me. <laughs> I got it at Torrid, which is like a plus size. Source of any plus size people love the Care Bears. I just got it recently too. <laughs> so I'm just gonna shake it up. Whoa, what are we, how are we doing this? <laughs> I told you there was a problem when I went to get it because it was giant. It was a huge block. I'm just shaking it up. I'm gonna pour it in the glass. I don't even know how to break this. <laughs> Hold on. Move this. So we got the drink poured. And then we're just gonna add something for some fun garnish. I'm calling it a smoking key lime. <laughs> what about an ice cream scoop? <laughs> you laugh. Listen to it. We're know. chiseling away at something, guys. Watch it fly in our eye or something. Are you ready to smoke like <laughs> We are not professional. <laughs> <laughs> but I have a Dude, try this. I've never had this. I do this at home all the time, but this is a giant. It's usually cracked up into smaller pieces. And oh. this is a giant. <laughs> it's gonna have to make a really big drink. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how long does it last for? Uh, well, it evaporates really quickly. Did you hear the sizzle the metal makes? Yeah. What the heck, guys? I'm we're getting in here. You guys wonder what we're doing? We're playing with a block of. Should we drop it on the floor? Oh my gosh, this we'll is make hilarious. A dent on the floor. I just want a piece to break off. We just let it evaporate really quickly. A hammer would be good. Okay, hold on. I got a little piece. I got a little piece. Yeah, very small piece. It, it's effective. Okay. It's effective. Okay. All right. <laughs> Make sure to okay. put this down here so people can see it. All right. Can we see the drink? Yeah. All right. Let's add it. Look! We have dry ice. So it is smoking. So what we have here is a lack of dry ice. You can buy it at lots of grocery stores. They have it in the front of the store in a cooler. It makes and little bubbles. It makes little bubbles. And then when and it they makes... pop, it smokes out. Yeah. So I call it a smoking key lime. Yeah, exactly, Deborah. Hey, kids, don't try this at home. <laughs> Jamie said time for a hammer. Um, but yeah, usually this was a giant unbroken off block. I didn't know what to do. So I just grabbed it. And uh, But you don't need a big piece. You just need a little piece. You can put it in. You can put it in a punch bowl. It was touching it and it was freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> the knife was, if you heard that loud noise. It sounded like that, a bell. <laughs> that was the metal knife touching the dry ice and metal against it makes like the squeaking sound. Yeah, witch's brew. Yeah, if you block. go to my TikTok, which is Mahokama. <laughs> yeah. Which is, it's the first two letters of me and everybody, my husband and my kids. So it's M A Matt H O Holly. C. O'Connor and M.A. Madison, Mahokama. I do have on my TikTok, I did one for Halloween and it has bubbles going to the music and everything. That one was really cool. It looks super cool. All right, you ready to try it, Alex? Sure. 
It's like a witch's, yeah, for Halloween, I call it a witch's brew. You can call it a, a swamp water. There you go. I know what it tastes like. I drink it, I drink it. It's very cold. It's very cold. Yes, there you go, Cynthia, Mohokama. Yes. That's key lime. It tastes just like key lime pie, doesn't it? It's fantastic. <laughs> I'm telling you, it is so good. It's so refreshing. Like for a summer drink, yeah. I think I learned that like a year ago, and I'm like, this is a summer drink. It's refreshing. It's good. You can add more. Yes, you can drink it while it's bubbling. Yeah. It is very cold though. Yeah. Okay, bad place for that. <laughs> I really want a bigger piece to put in there, but I'm just throwing it up before, apparently. But that's full. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're not supposed to, can I just say you're not supposed to touch it with your hands? Yeah, yeah. You're definitely That's why we're like being super careful with it. Oh, it just did a, 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 a ring. Yeah. yeah, I know. In my... If you go to my TikTok, you'll see a flame and drink, and uh, it yeah, it keeps doing puff rings, like yeah. perfect circles. It's really cool. You just need a little bit more. That's why I'm trying to do a little more. What kind of liquor is in the key lime drink? Don, it's just whipped cream vodka. And lime. Yeah. So the two ingredients, again, in case anybody missed it, whipped cream vodka and simply limeade, not lemonade, but limeade. It is so yummy, Deanna. That is very good. It tastes just like key lime pie. You found a new drink, you love it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Delicious. Easy to make. It's so weird because I'm out of camera. I'm just. Are we done with the uh, those? So, cheers, everyone. Hold on. Yeah. Okay. So, so we're finished with our cocktails for tonight. We made two of those. So cheers. No. Oh my gosh! I almost knocked mine over on camera. <laughs> <laughs> I, it's delayed, so I was looking at the the screen. Okay, so have all the pieces here. Am I? I guess I'm putting it together. You made the drinks. Okay, that's fine. Cause I'm not so. <laughs> all right. So I'm gonna start with this. I get the glue from back here. So again, you take toilet seat cover. Toilet seat cover. And it goes through here, through the back of this. And we used foil for this. Uh, I don't know if this is the best font for foil, but for the most part, it came out pretty good. But this piece just goes back here. <laughs> your little, your drink looks so fun and festive, like. <laughs> <on the camera. laughs> And then, I'm already hot. I'm like, how do I, I'm one of those people when I drink, I get like my temperature goes up so much. I'm like, I'm already burning up. I have this drink. I'm going to be. <laughs> and this is my hot. second one. Uh -huh. I know. <laughs> <laughs> this is my first. And I'm just taping, or taping, I'm gluing that to the back of that. So then you can lift this up. Because, uh. Huh, Deanna said, now we need to add a cocktail emoji. Oh, yeah. That's fun. Alex made emojis of me recently, so there's two of them that are me and... Oh, yeah, Penny used one. I see me. I used one in the beginning, too. Did you? Yeah. So, yeah, there's one of me with a head with a rainbow over it, and then, you know... Next, I'm doing fun. Real Holly, there's one of me riding a chubby unicorn. I told Alex, it can't be the regular unicorn. It's got to be the chubby unicorn, because <laughs> the regular unicorn ain't going to be able to carry me. <laughs> 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 oh, thanks, Shirley. Awesome. Oh, Grandma's watching. Thanks, Mom. Pamela. Hey, if you thanks, see Grandma. Her, that's our mom. Well, my mom. Alex's grandma. Melody's uh -huh. mom. I think my brother might be in here, too. But I don't think he's saying anything. Okay. Now, I've put the glue on here. I'm going to try to get it on here as well as I can. may have put way too much glue. Yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> do we have any... Do we do you? Do we have any... Well, I don't know about foam tape, so... Thanks, or foam. Shirley. We try to be fun. We have fun a lot. We like... Like, 
laugh ridiculously. <laughs> yeah. Do we get any uh, paper towels? I'm or gonna... wet wipes, maybe? <laughs> yeah, there's wet wipes behind you. Like, I just organized all this. Like, <laughs> wet wipes. Oh, this thanks, Marianne. Right here. here go. Mary or Marie? Is it? I don't know. I'm terrible at names. Marie, not really wet. Marie thank you, Marie. Uh, Robin, my TikTok is Mahokomo. So M A H O C O M A. Mine is Beard Adventures. That used to be my Facebook before it got hacked a year ago. It was Mahokomo because the whole family used it. So I just made a name that covered all of us. And we were the only Mahokomos. So it worked out. I know people are like, is that like an Indian name? Like a. Like a Native American, you know, name. I'm like, no, it's just the first two letters of all of our names. <laughs> okay. I don't put a ton on TikTok. I haven't in a while, but there's some fun stuff. There's some stuff I use Cricut on when I decorated. I made like paintings and stuff. Uh, there's some funny times during COVID, you know, when nobody could come over, you couldn't see people. So we had our basement was like our own personal club. And uh, we have a Danny DeVito cutout and a Snape from Harry Potter. So there's pictures of us with Snape and Danny DeVito and I got flower lays on them and some raros and I'm taking pictures with them. Like, you know. How many of these Danny do you DeVito want to use? With us? These are uh, 2D fruity embellishment things from Re Recollections. Yeah, we just got them at Michael's. Uh, I believe if I do this and enter. There is a link to what we're using as the little shaker pieces. I thought the little fruits, I was like, we gotta find little fruits to put in there. It's a drink. Yeah. Think of like are... a sangria. It could be a white wine sangria, the color and all. There's a lot of little itty bitty fruit pieces. For... <laughs> it's cute. There's is that enough or should we do a little more? I think you should do more. Alex, I think most of his glitter out of his beard has fallen off. I oh, think. yeah. He was literally leaving. Yes, at the end of yesterday, it was almost gone. Yeah. Well, I put more on yesterday. so. We were laughing, saying he was literally leaving a little sparkle wherever he went. That was no joke, because it was falling out of his beard. Is that good? Let it all settle, and then yeah, yeah. he'll be Let's able to shake it. it. So the top sheet will yeah. go down. Oh, Shannon, you got your spider. Spider. Spinner sliders this week. Nice. Awesome. Tootie now, fruity, a wop bop, a hula, a wop bam bang. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you want to put this. Oh, Rudy. You want to put that together? Yeah. Okay. Give me a second. I'll, I'll put. It. Now you could use red line tape for this. Yeah. Um, but since there wasn't really like that weird yellow color of foam, we did white foam. What I'm going to do is just put a th hopefully a thinner line than before along the top. My blue doesn't work. I know. That's why, that's why I was like, you just give me a second, let me do this one. And then I'm putting the acetate down. Craft time with cocktails. Everybody does those paint and sip, so. Right. I'm like, let's do a. We don't have to lose our leave our home or pay money. And then and then and then Are you waiting on me? Yeah, you're okay though. Okay. I have glue all over my fingertips. We are supposed to leave glitter wherever we go. There's yeah. snow on the ground here. Gross. And now thunder and lightning. I like the thunder and lightning part. Oh yeah, some ice cube embellishments would work also. Oh yeah, that would be really cute. Let's steal this real quick. That glue needs a smaller hole. Well, they have it, but I don't know where it's at. You have to like do a real light <laughs> squeeze on it. So 
Because there's gonna... like a, a small pin that would go in there. Yeah. Anyways, what were you saying? I was saying that we're going to do this at least once a month. So we're going to do the crafting cocktails at least once a month. Um, and we may, if you guys like it and want to do it more, um, we'll do it every two weeks. It's like having a little fun getaway with friends without leaving. Here's your little umbrella, sir. All right. Thank you, Terry. That was so sweet. Thank you, Terry. It's okay, Betty, that you're late. Luckily, we replay everything. Uh, or we'll replay it. Restream so you can see what you missed. You did miss some cocktails. Alex. I would say maybe in the future to this part, uh, maybe get another piece of... Uh-oh. They're leaking. They're leaking. We have a... Uh, an opening. We have a breach. You don't want them to lose their fruits everywhere. We do need a little laughter in this life, Lonnie. Uh, me and Alex yesterday seen a sign and I laughed and it said, what did it say? If uh, you can't laugh at yourself, call me because I will. Yeah. Because I always yeah. say, like, I'm the first one to laugh at myself. I will laugh ridiculously, you know. Yeah. It won't bother me. Like, we need laughs. We need lots of laughs in this life. Like it's good stress relief. You gotta, I feel like, do you release endorphins when you laugh? I don't know. They say you do when you work out and sometimes we laugh so hard it's a workout. So I think that should say yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like we laugh in our abs or sometimes we're like, oh, we're gonna feel that tomorrow. So I'm gonna say yeah. Sounds so, right. could they, so could you have an exercise section that is just... Hi, Pulani. Um, can you have an exercise session like laughter? Where you're like, ha, ha, ha. You know, <laughs> 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 he's just at the gym. Oh, what are you doing? It's sitting in that chair. Ha, 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 ha. The whole class. You just go to exercise class and everybody does different laughs. <laughs> Cynthia <laughs> let's be honest, our fruitiness is all over the place. <laughs> okay. okay, I think I used enough glue now. But yeah, I would probably do a craft board piece to glue on the back of this to just give it a little bit more, like, strength. Yeah, we were thinking that too. We were like, yeah. I think this is going to might need some more. Uh, Kathy, yes. She's, he said, or Kathy, Kathy said we need to tell them what the ingredients are for the cocktail beforehand. I agree. Yeah, we will yeah. do that next we time. Were, we were running late on some stuff for sure. Yeah. Should we, doing so much. should we glue the cherries to the Cynthia, umbrella first? Yes, I can post the drink recipes. Where should I post those? This is the question. Um,. I don't necessarily want to post them in the Facebook groups. So there is laughter workouts. Saw it on Oprah years ago. See? <laughs> See? Uh, Pulani says the box is on her way to you. I okay. can't post the drink recipes. I will. Let's see. Um, maybe I'll make a post uh, in community on YouTube. Actually, it would just make sense to edit this description. Yeah. Oh, okay. thank you, Terry. Thank you, Terry. I'm going to edit the description of this video when it's over, and then it'll have the drink recipes in there for you. Make a new section in Patreon. I could, and I could put a post on Patreon, too. Yep, Patreon, Patreon. All right, so I will update the description, and I'm going to do a post after Patreon um, with the link that has the... Well, not the link. I'm just going to put what's in the drinks. Yes. And blue curacao and grenadine, you can use that in so many things. Like, yeah. At, do you still drink Shirley? Well, no. Shirley Temples? <laughs> you probably no. haven't put alcohol in it at this point, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I still, it's not, I'll still make a Shirley Temple at home every now. My kids love Shirley Temples. Six and seven up for Sprite and add a little grenadine to it. Uh, it tastes like my childhood because we always went to the boat club. Like we were big on the boat. Yeah. And, you know, there was a bar in the boat club. And obviously I was a child, so I didn't get a drink. But they'd always make me a, a Shirley Temple. They called it a kitty cocktail too. So with this, yeah, I would, I would definitely get this piece, another piece of this. You could detach the, the writing 
and just duplicate it to make it a little bit stronger. The umbrella does swing a little bit, but not too bad. Not too bad. We thought that might be worse because so. it is kind of heavier than the rest. It says, it's your birthday. There's little pieces shaking around. Some are pretty stuck to the side. Yeah, coconut rum, that, Denise, that is... And then you open it up. That is my jam. Every hour is happy hour. See, you're never too old for a Shirley Temple. I'm... I believe it. Jamie loves the shaker card. That's it. <laughs> That's all that was. I think it's adorable, though. Put the pin in the glue. It's cute. It's really cute. And it's hard to see with all the... Can you guys see all the fruits in there? There's some of everything in there. That's adorable. You want to show them your drink for the ones who have... Oh, it's half gone now, oh, but it yeah. was a ra <laughs> That's sad. I can make you another one, Alex. I'm okay right now. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, who liked the card? All right. I like to say in the villages, I made my parents a thing years ago to hang on their wall and it says, uh... Oh, here we can move that over to the side. All right, Alex is gonna fix something. Yeah. <laughs> what he needs an envelope line. There we go. All right, there we go. What was I saying? I don't know. Oh, I made my parents a, a shadow box with the cricket for their house, and it says, Welcome to Tom and Suzette's, where every hour is happy hour. Because I say here, every hour is happy hour. What was in my drink again? Uh, Alex's drink was... Captain Morgan. Captain Morgan coconut rum, but you can use Malibu. That was the alcohol, and then pineapple juice, um, blue curacao, and blue. grenadine. Blue curacao. Blue curacao. Curacao. It's like that. <laughs> blue curacao. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway the red's heavy so you pour the red slow the red sinks to the bottom and then the blue you pour over the back of a spoon slowly on top and the blue floats so it kind of it goes rainbow color and the pineapple juice gives you the yellow um since we're right here yes. scared me knocked something over since we're right here what are oh, we we're right do? here Oh, and, then Alex, and then the other drink was just whipped cream of vodka and simply limeade, which is delish. Like, it's so easy, it shouldn't taste that much like key lime pie. Right. Thanks, Lori. Like I said, you guys are our guinea pigs for this. This is our first time. This isn't how we would normally be set up. <laughs> Right. I will never make a drink again sitting down because it's bizarre and I don't like it. <laughs> you can stand up behind the bar. So there. Now I'm going to save this into it. Uh, just this piece would be craft board. Um, white, black, brown, whatever. Craft board you have to uh, just make this, the card a little bit stronger. And save. Yep, non-alcoholic Shirley Temples. Those are easy. Just give you some Sprite or 7-Up and add the grenadine. And this is YouTube. You're watching what we're watching. <laughs> and now it's back to us. <laughs> now it's back to us. Oh my God. Uh, someone sent us the pin. I don't remember who sent it. Um, it's a really great idea, though, so you don't... I don't want to say a name because I, I have a couple names in mind, but it was last year. Magical Crafty Mom says, I love crafting with cocktails. Whenever I craft, I have a drink about 99% of the time. That's 1% crafting. 1% crafting, 99% drinking. Just get <laughs> uh, Sometimes, depending on the project, sometimes it's like, ooh, maybe I'll start drinking halfway through because if I start at the beginning. <laughs> but it's happy hour here. We were, were by the squares yesterday and they were packed. They were super packed. They were so packed. And so, you know, we're in a retirement community, 55 and over, and we're driving and they're playing like 90s hip hop in the square with all these, you know, people living their golden years. They were playing crisscross, jump, jump. And I was like, this is, this is are they jumping? Are they jumping? <laughs> we couldn't see because we were in the car, but it was, was it Maymay May made it? Uh, Maymay May made it many of. No, so she has different ones that you can buy. But this isn't. 
I feel like someone made this. Dances with Pam it is so good. It's too drink. It, I can't even tell you. When I found this, I was like, that's amazing. I feel like I specialize in desserts for drinks. I make a cherry cheesecake drink. That's delish. I make uh, what's the other one? strawberry shortcake, which tastes just like strawberry shortcake. And that mixture you would not think tastes like strawberry shortcake. Strawberry shortcake. Pineapple upside down cake is a go-to. Tastes just like pineapple upside down cake. Ooh, Robin said fireball. Ooh. I'm not a big fan of Fireball. Fireball had its moment. <laughs> yeah, like, uh, although it is like um, a cinnamon, a red hot. It tastes like a red hot. Yeah, I just, I'm just not. I like red hots. I just don't like Fireball. Well, I don't like anything that tastes like alcohol. I just like fruity drinks. I like yeah. a drink that makes you feel like you're sitting on a beach on vacation. Not like what I had you try the other night. No, Alex. <laughs> it was delicious. There was nothing delicious about that. It was so then. good. It was there smooth. was nothing. <laughs> you didn't think it was smooth by your face. Siri wants the strawberry shortcake one. I will do the strawberry shortcake one. I'll probably do that one next. Oh, absolutely. I love strawberry shortcake, the character. And Holly Hobby. Growing up, my best friend growing up, she passed away in a car accident as a teenager, but her dad always called me Holly Hobby. So I love that. I have good memories of that. Yeah, Strawberry Shortcake, The Care Bears, My Little Pony, Rainbow Bright. I seen a shirt uh, before I came and it said Made in the 80s and it had My Little Pony on it. And I want to make a shirt that says Made in the 80s with My Little Pony, Rainbow Bright, Strawberry Shortcake, and Care Bear. Did I get them all covered? Sure. <laughs> Back when cartoons were good and we had Saturday morning cartoons. That's not a, is that a thing I, anymore? I remember Saturday morning cartoons. What did you watch? Cartoons. <laughs> See, they weren't even memorable. That's my point. No, exactly. No. You don't even know. <laughs> there was like there was a bunch of different ones, but it was like the Looney Tunes stuff was on. And no, then, but that's like that's old school. That's not even like from your era. Rocket Power. Never heard of it. It was great. It's a great show. Show me. Take me into a store where I can buy a Rocket Power T-shirt. Let's go to Nickelodeon. <laughs> <laughs> Not memorable. <laughs> 80s cartoons were memorable. So were 90s for the 90 kids. <laughs> <laughs> True. <laughs> yeah. Robin said Schoolhouse Rock. Johnny Quest. Beep, beep. That's Andrea. That's, and that's Andrea we were with yesterday, yesterday, right? Yeah, Andrea Park. Yeah. So we went to dinner last night with Andrea that's Park. Meet, meet. Meet, oh, meet, meet. Beep, beep. I was going to say, that's the alert for my phone is uh, Roadrunner. Yeah. Meep, meep. So, but we had fun. We went to dinner with Andrea. I got to meet her mother-in-law. See? He just finished his second rainbow drink. Don't make the... <laughs> Deanna said, he just finished his second rainbow drink. Don't I'm make the questions too hard. I'm bad enough at things anyways. But Rocket Power is like my go-to cartoon. Yeah, I've never heard of that in my life. And Dexter's Lab. Oh, I've heard of Dexter's Lab. Not great, though. Uh... <laughs> The, um... Be judgmental against your cartoon. Yeah. Flintstones. Yes, Dove. Flintstones and the Jetsons. I loved both of them. I said, you know, I always was like, where's my Rosie? I need my Rosie. I call my, um, navigation on the car Rosie. I was like, that's the closest thing I got. But I really thought when I was growing up, like, by 2020, we will be in flying cars like the Jetsons. Here I am, <laughs> still waiting. Oh, <laughs> Alex liked Barney, too. Yeah, when I was... Little kid, I was like this tall. I still <laughs> sing the clean up song to my kids when they were little. I'd say, Clean up, clean up, everybody everywhere. Clean up, clean up, everybody do your share. Do you remember that? No, it's from Barney. I still sing it. Teenage, I would always sing it to the kids. Gem, I, I watched yes. Teenage, yes. The Popples, yeah. I don't remember the gummy bears. I do remember the Popples. No, I was in the newspaper I because the, I won a Popple from I watched Taco the Bell. I didn't like it, that was dumb. My Roomba is Rosie. Yes, Debbie. If I have a Roomba, I am naming her Rosie. But didn't we think, like, the Jetsons made us think we would be so far advanced. I really wanted a thing where they just go in the kitchen and they're like, you know, give me this and then boom, it pops up. Inspector Gadget. You, I feel like the Tesla, though, is close. Because, like, George Jetson could, like, sit in his car, take a net, whatever. You know, his car flew itself. Yeah. So we've gotten a little close with the Teslas that drive themselves. Scooby-Doo. Smurfs. Oh, yeah. Of Smurfs. I just bought my daughter's Smurf shirt this week, actually. He-Man. Gumby. I remember Gumby. Gumby hey. and Pokey. I love this. We have gotten into, like, the best. Sweet drinks can be very dangerous, Murray. That is true. So I said drink 
responsibly. Um, yeah, I watched, do you know who Gumby is? Yeah. Okay. So I watched Gumby. Gumby. My Roomba's name is Rudy. He's got a horse, I don't remember the horse's name. Pokey. Oh, okay. Gumby and Pokey. Terrible names in general. I know. Alex <laughs> is 10 years younger than me, so he doesn't remember all these. Yeah, the Flintstones. Yeah, I watched the Smurfs. Just think about, I always think now, Inspector is that it's like, the Flintstones, there's no way they got around with their feet. Can you imagine what their feet, bottom of their feet would look like? That They'd be, be shredded. Inspector Gadget. We just talked about him today. Was it today? Yeah, well, we talked, actually, we talked about Inspector Gadget <laughs> two days recently. <laughs> but today with that dog, remember that dog that jumped over the fence oh, and his yeah. tail did a helicopter? And I was like, he was oh. like... Go go gadget copter. Oh, the other time was at the restaurant. Like, Yosemite Sam. I have. <laughs> that was really funny because that camera's on the way, and I just see my hand doing yeah. <laughs> Underdog. That's probably like. I remember like, underdog. Yeah, yeah. Hard as rock feet. They had to be shredded or something. Uh, what was what? Uh, the weird cartoons that were canceled. <sighs> Mom, no, is it? I don't know. I have a, one of the Pop Funkos. The guy holds his up. But He-Man and She-Ra. I watched I that. Look it up watch that. I've seen He-Man, didn't like it. So, I love how we got into all these cartoons. The people know the good cartoons. Foghorn oh, Lager, Real Monsters. Yogi Bear. Yes. Real Monsters. Tennessee Tuxedo. What is that? Voltron, the A-Team. Dinosaurs, not the not, not the, mama. the mama, not the mama, yeah. not the mama. Bullwinkle and Rocky. Yeah. Hey, no, that's no, no that's wrong. <laughs> I was gonna say, hey boo boo, hey, boo, -boo. you wanna have a picnic basket? <laughs> that's, that's a really bad Ren, Ren and Stimpy. That's a really bad Powerpuff Yogi Bear Girls. impression. I watched a lot of Powerpuff Girls. This show is cool. <laughs> the bad guy. Love not the mama. Not the mama. I don't know. They're just not the same, though. Cartoons aren't the same. No, I don't know what they are now. They're very bizarre. There's some very bizarre ones. I like... Um, oh, that's awesome, Mindy. The, the Cat, beavers. Not the mama dinosaur. Cat dog. <laughs> I don't know those. Those are dumb. Those are really those. dumb. Rugrats. I mean, that... Like, I love Rugrats. Rugrats. Yeah. Okay. Me too. My daughter loves Rugrats. Tennessee... How do you not know about Tennessee Tuxedo? He was a penguin. And he ran around with a wolf. We need to look this Never up. Never heard of Tennessee Tuxedo. Karen, we are going to look up Tennessee Tuxedo. Because you know Alex like considers himself a penguin. So she owns Re Barney Rubble feet? The Teletubbies. Oh yeah, I remember like the that Teletubbies. Either. That was weird. I did not know. You didn't watch Teletubbies? Uh-uh. Me, me. I don't know. They just made different no noises. I've seen Oh, Denise, I'm sorry to hear but that. But I never, like... Enjoyed it. So sad. I'm sorry to hear that. Rugrats were very popular. The Rugrats are popular now. My daughter's got some Rugrats clothes. Rugrats are back. And that whole Nickelodeon era came back. I follow the, the, the lady on TikTok that does a voice for Tommy. Oh, really? Yeah. It's That's funny awesome. because she'll go into a store and do it. And then people's re reactions. Yeah, Denise, I agree. Those Teletubbies. I was like, how the little baby was the son, and then it was the worst. <laughs> it was a little frightening. Oh, oh, Fraggle Rock. Do you know what Fraggle Rock is? No, that's a fragile. Daddy's <laughs> <laughs> world. <laughs> no, that was funny. <laughs> um, no, was Fraggle funny. Rock. They were. I mean, it was done by, like, Jim Henson, the Muppets, right? So they okay. were like Muppets. They were these people, puppet. How do you describe them? That lived under the... Down to Fraggle Rock. Do, do, do. No? That sounds... Somewhat... Down to Fraggle Rock. And the one was called Red, and she had red... I'll show them. It was a Muppet thing? Yeah. Oh, Friends were I used to watch... And they lived... And there was an old man... I hated the Muppets. Who lived upstairs, I remember. And like Andrew's like and talking about cartoons, right? I feel like we're all reminiscent right now. <laughs> KV Caveman? Never heard of that. Casper. I do I love the Casper. friendly ghosts. Yes. Pee Wee's Playhouse. Yes. Yeah. Mecca Lecca High, Mecca Heidi Ho. No. Nope. Do you know what that is? 
if it's from Pee Wee's Playhouse, I couldn't get through it. I it was, it was the, the head in the box. And then he was like, I don't know, was he psychic or whatever? And he'd say, Mecca Lecca Hi, Mecca Heidi Ho. Mr. Rogers, did you ever watch Mr. Rogers? Yeah. Okay. I watched you, Mr. Ed too. Did you see the movie, Mr. Rogers? With I did. Hanks? My mom and I went and watched it. It was actually very good. Yeah. Very good. Kermit, I know. My brother used to tell me, and it, it ain't a lie. The cartoon about the skunks? The French skunks. Oh, you're talking no, about Pepe Le Pew. Yeah, that's no longer on TV. Why? Because. Because. They took Pepe Le Pew's yeah. offensive? Yeah. Pepe Le Pew was offensive? Ah, uh, what were we talking about? Yo Gabba Gabba. Oh, man, I said yo that Gabba. Really. Oh, you did. Okay. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> yo Gabba Oh, Gabba. I loved Kermit. That's where I was at, stuff. Um, so, my brother said, and it wasn't a lie, like, if you, I looked a little like Miss Piggy as a teenager. Not because I was fat, because I was a lot skinnier than when I thought I was really fat, but, <laughs> so, uh, actually, if you look at the picture, I mean, it, it was like the shape of my eyes and everything, and then we used to decorate the boat for Venetian nights on the river, and one year my dad did, it was right after Jim Henson died, and he did a tribute to Jim Henson. And he made a big cloud that lit up that said, thank you, Jim Henson. And we had Kermit. And they rented the Miss Piggy full, huh. like, from a hollow, like, full costume Mrs. Piggy. So I really got to be Miss Piggy. And then one time I did date a guy that looked just like Kermit. And I was like, uh, 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 we're like Kermit and Miss uh, Piggy. Uh, <laughs> no lie. <laughs> Romper room. I don't remember that. Oh, that's so funny. Hooey Dewey and Louie. Yeah, my husband loves them. Do you know who Hooey Dewey and Louie are? Mm, sounds familiar, but I don't think so. They're uh, Donald Duck's, you know, oh. the small ones. There's Hooey yeah. Dewey and Louie. <laughs> you know what doesn't make sense? In what? Goofy. You know, I don't remember Goofy's dog's name. Goofy has a dog? Yeah. Goofy. But he is a dog, right? Right. Goofy's a dog, but he has a dog. Okay. Why can't they understand each other? They're both dogs in the same world. But Goofy speaks English. Dog doesn't. That's really What's weird. Goofy's dog's name? Pluto. Oh my gosh, Marianne. How cool is that? Marianne was on the Howdy Doody show when she was little. Pluto. Is that right? Yeah. Oh, I thought... I didn't, Pluto was Goofy's? Yeah. I was going to say Pluto. Yep. They knew that. I, did, I thought Pluto was just another dog. I didn't know he was related to Goofy. What's Goofy's no, son's name? I have no idea. Max. Yeah, You've never seen the Goofy movie? Probably not. My kids liked it. His son's name's Max. I know that. You should know that. You want a cookie? <laughs> <laughs> from I chicken do. salad chick? <laughs> I do want a cookie from chicken salad chick. That it's was the so best good. little cookie I've ever had. <laughs> the chicken salad was delicious too, but I'm like, why is this little cookie so good? <laughs> oh, Helen had Mickey a prince. That's cute. Oh. When she was a little kid, she had a crush on Prince Johan from the Smurfs. That's hilarious. Tweety Bird. I thought I caught. No. Nope. Look, I always try to do these horrible impressions, and I'm absolutely horrible at all of them. I thought I saw a putty tat. I did. I did. I did. I did. Like that. I, does not sound. Yeah, I agree with Leanne. I always thought that Pluto was Mickey's dog. Yeah, that's what also. everyone's saying. There's, he Garfield. has a dog. And then Garfield. What about Odie? Or not Odie. Everybody knows Odie with Garfield. But what about Heathcliff? I used to love Heathcliff when I was a kid, too. He was a mischievous little... Did you see the new... Um, <laughs> Kimberly loves my horrible impressions. <laughs> <laughs> Snagglepuss. Exit stage look. Snagglepuss. What is Snagglepuss? Snuffle. I was like Snuffleupic. Snuffleupicus. Luffagus. Snuffleupicus. Okay, well, someone look up who. <laughs> what's Goofy's Snagglepuss. Dog yeah, we gotta look that up. Leanne, you have us curious. We want to know what Snagglepuss is. Heathcliff was good. Snoopy and the Peanuts. Absolutely. You still gotta watch the Great Pumpkin. It's the Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Every Halloween. <laughs> John. Big Bird hasn't aged a bit. I don't know what his secret is, but he hasn't gained. He was a lion. Yes, cognitive being. Hey, that's my brother. He's here. 
He, he's hidden. Oh. Where? Right there. He said Rainbow Bright. That, you're right, but you know what? You spelled bright wrong. It's B-R-I-T-E. I can say that because that's my brother Alex's nephew. Melody's brother's in here also. So, he finally spoke up, so we know he's here. Oh, exit stage left was his famous line. Okay, so he is Mickey's pet. Officially a mixed breed dog, he made his debut I as a bloodhound in the Mickey Mouse cartoon. Really? But, what's his face? Always walks him. See? He's Goofy. like... Oh, okay. Yeah, so... But they're in the same universe! How are they not... Communicate? Yeah. I don't know, that's a good question. Oh, the wild thornberries. Yeah, the that girl was... could talk to the animals. Yeah. Yeah. That like was that. Rugrats era. Same as for that. Same as uh. I know Howdy Doody Crafty. I don't know Alex. Power. You don't know Howdy. No. You've heard of it though, right? Howdy Doody. Fuck me, everyone! The Howdy Doody show. No. I feel like we could just do impersonations all day, and it'd be <laughs> horrible. Because sometimes yeah. it's so funny. Thundercats was good. I liked She-Ra. Or He-Man. The that. Pink Panther. Yep. <laughs> Twilight, I would love to see that picture. She said she had to make a rainbow bright costume without a pattern. I would love to see that picture. Speed Racer, absolutely. Yeah, watch that. There was a show with Goldar, Radar, and Silbar. Those are fun. I don't know that. You know what's funny about the Smurfs? Just the other day. Right before I left, we were at the store, and I bought my daughter a Smurf shirt. And I was like, who is that on the back? And my husband said, Dopey? And I said, that's not Dopey. I said, you got it wrong. He's like, is it Sleepy? I'm like, no, you are literally naming the seven dwarfs. These are Smurfs. They don't have the name of the seven dwarfs. Oh, that's funny. It was funny. George the Jungle. Yeah. George, George, George of the Jungle. Watch, Watch out for the tree. tree. <laughs> Betty Boop. Boris and... This is so fun. We just all... How many of us... Yeah, Pound Puppies. That's one that hasn't been said either. I used to love the Pound Puppies. I collected them. And the My Little Ponies. I had like the carriages for them that you would put like 20 in. And I had tons. Gargamel. What is it? Gargamel? Gargamel, yeah. It says it was Gargamel. Disney son. Ayana was a 70s and 80s cartoon baby. I really do think the 80s win. Hands down. We all believe. <laughs> so, well, I hope you guys had fun with us with our little acting with cocktails thing. It's been an hour. So let us know, comment, what, and like I said, we'll update the description with what's drinks and we will make a Patreon post. Um. But let us know if you guys want to do it more than once a month and do it twice a month. We'll do that. Because I think it's really fun. I'm at home by myself anyway when we have drinks, so we might as well craft and have fun with everybody. There you go. Olive oil. Yeah, Popeye. Popeye the Sailor Man. I'll gladly pay you Tuesday for our hamburger today. Curious George. I did love Curious George. The man in the yellow hat. So, what are you playing with over there, Alex? These? Hey, okay, Jamie, I'm glad. I hope you guys had fun. The pineapple upside down drink. That has been my signature. I would say the pineapple upside down drink is like my signature drink I made forever. You can make it for shots too, and there's, you know, so, however you want to do it. Yeah, anything with pineapple, Mindy, I agree. I'm a huge pineapple fan, especially in drinks. It makes it sweet, um, covers the alcohol. So, and the strawberry shortcake one I'll share because the ingredients I put in it, you would not think tastes like strawberry shortcake. And when I made it, I'm like, there's no way this is going to taste like strawberry shortcake. And then we're like, holy cow, why does it taste exactly uh, like uh, there's uh, no strawberry in it? No strawberry in it. Weird. It tastes just like strawberry shortcake. So. Yes, yeah, so I will be coming back to the villages. I live in the villages, so. Uh, Mindy says one of the clubs in the villages has pineapple princess cake and it was the best ever. Mmm. Sounds interesting. It sounds delicious. So. Well, Peggy, we loved you guys being with us. It's been an hour. Let's get into the the closing time part of this. Um, Andrea, I will be coming in Zoom more, especially once everything gets set up and settled down. Yeah, we, um, I want to pop in Zoom at least once a week is my plan. Because yeah. I have fun with this. I want to talk to you guys, chat with you guys. I enjoy it. I'm really, like, nervous to be on camera. Like, Alex will tell you, like, it took 
for 10 years. I'm like, I don't want to be on camera. Yeah. Like Melody got eased into it. She only showed her hands for years. Yeah. Um, but as I do it more, I just said, you know what I got to do? Just don't look at the replay. Cause I'm like, Ooh, uh, yeah, we don't like watching replays. Why then we always so pause weird. at the worst time. Like, why, is weird my, face. why is this like this? Yeah. My hair, I never have a good hair day, by the way, guys. I have thin, fine hair, so I do not have Melody's hair, so. Twice a week, please. Twice a week, please. <laughs> That's a lot. It may get. It may become a weekly thing, too, at some point, so I really enjoyed it. How yeah. You? yeah, 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 for sure. It was sure. a fun time. But it has been an hour, so we're going we're gonna to go ahead and get going here. Cocktails um, in Zoom, absolutely. Like I've been on the same. I have, like I'm really drinking. I'm drinking the same. I'm bad with that. <laughs> Talk too much. Don't drink enough. <laughs> the uh, Tuesday will be our next video. We're going to be doing our perception crafts. So it's a Happy Mother's Day card. I <laughs> I'd say that neither of us have seen, but there is a. I have seen Holly's because she uh, she did not cover hers up, so I saw what hers looks like, but I don't know what it does. I didn't know open it or anything. Uh, she has not seen mine yet. Earlier, we... was like, oh no. And I was like, I thought I, because we covered it with a big square, but then I redid it and didn't cover that one, apparently. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, mm. I, I don't know. It looks prettier than mine. I'll say that much. <laughs> That's what we thought would be fun. Just come up with ideas, see yeah. what each of us make. And it'll be for Mother's Day, so we'll do it Tuesday. That way, if anybody wants to make them, there's still time for Mother's Day. Yes. So. so. And, and then, then Friday. Friday is new... New images, and that's kind of all we have. You guys will see me right fluff now. my hair a lot because I don't have a good hair day and it gets super flat in two seconds. But if I fluff, I get like a good four seconds out. <laughs> <laughs> that's about it. So, what's the best time for Zoom? Uh, there's a lot of people in there throughout the day. Um, yeah, Andrea, even, uh, even through the middle of the night. Here, Dub, is Dub still in here? I'm not sure. Um, so. Yeah, and Zoom is just kind of all over the time. Just pop in. It, you know, if it's not busy, then you can go out. But there's usually a couple people in there. Or almost if you're, all the if time. If you're crafting, go ahead and stay in there and see if someone joins. Yeah, and if you are in the Zoom and nobody's there, you can also like go post in say Patreon and a Patreon group if you're on Facebook. And here's a card from tonight. <laughs> it's hard to it's, see them. Yeah, all the pieces got. Stuck. Do they hit Stuck. the glue? Yeah, they get glue. <laughs> <laughs> but that's the card from tonight. It's a little shaker. It says, it's, it's your birthday. Every hour is happy hour. Closing. Oh, you gotta live your life that way where every hour is happy hour. So I when mean, I work. It's sad moments, but then you're like, nope. When it's I work. It's a sad moment. It's not a bad day. It's a bad moment. You get on it and you move through it. When I worked at the college, I would put an earphone in or like an earbud mm -hmm. in my ear, and um, I, I would, you know how bad I sing. Going through the college, you sing like an the angels have the angels are upon me. If they were deaf. <laughs> <laughs> no. So he got his mother's singing ability. I'll just say. That. Yeah, yeah, a hundred percent. So when I would go through the college, locking up the doors, and I had to kick people out. Mm -hmm. I would always play closing time. I'd restart the song in the next building. <laughs> closing time. <laughs> Mindy, that's a perfect idea. I said the same thing too. This is definitely the perfect card for retirement too, because when you're retired, every hour can be happy hour. So, yeah, they want us to go into the Zoom for an after party. Uh -uh. <laughs> so like a VIP after right? party here. There's so how Deborah. Long? Deborah. There's Deborah. Yeah, Deborah's in Zoom a lot, Andrea's in Zoom a lot, um, and they're awesome. Jill, I know Jill's at a conference, so she's not in here right now. But the Zoom's an awesome place to go be so Just like we're doing now and we're being social, they're doing that same thing in the Zoom every day. And it's not just two people talking. It's like amongst it, you get to talk back. You get to, instead of chatting back, you can talk. Yeah. Even sometimes they play like a game in there. They have a whole lollipop thing, which I didn't know about until I got in there. Um, but you'll have to go in to see. So. Why is that held for review? Well, I don't know. Uh, because it, a lot of different. You oh. can hit show. It's uh, just because it's showing so many. So it, it looks spammy. Siri Love doesn't know where to find the Zoom. Siri, are you. Let's see. Are you. I'm going to. You're on Patreon. Correct, Siri? Because I can make another post on Patreon. 
that will give you the link to the Zoom. Let's see, they're just being spammy. Okay. Do you have to be on camera? No. You don't have to. Uh, you can turn the audio on, video off. Um, but if you go in, I turn your audio on because other it's just kind of creepy if somebody sits in there and nobody <laughs> says anything. <laughs> um, if you don't feel comfortable showing yourself right away, you can just turn your audio on and you can talk to everyone. You can see them. If you're, um, and if, as you get comfortable, because I'm sure you will, because they're great ladies. As you get comfortable, then you can show yourself. No more lollipops are on the popcorn now. Popcorn, Pulani. I was just saying, I'm going to like literally get a thing of lollipops uh, and put it on my shelf behind me. And no more lollipops. Okay, well, they're not doing lollipops, but apparently there's a popcorn thing. So, uh... Okay, I, Sari, I'll make the post on Patreon for all the Patreons, and I'll put the link in there for the Zoom, so you guys can go ahead and go in there. So. I do want to say, if you do join the Zoom... And there is quite a few people in there, just a few people. Just be courteous. If there's a TV on behind you, mute the TV or um, mute yourself if someone is watching the TV. Just so, you know, when someone's trying to talk, they're not being quieted down from the sound of the TV in the background. Yeah. Kimberly be... said they made me feel very comfortable. That's awesome. I went in there not knowing, and they made me. I was like, this is fun. I need yeah. to do this more often. We've been incredibly busy, so... But once everything calms down to, like, a normal, I'm going to be going in there way more. <laughs> There's no normal. <laughs> okay, but March was insane. Yeah, yeah, We had five yeah. mystery boxes in March. All those videos that yeah. seem like they shouldn't take long because they're, like, five-minute video, but take ridiculously long. Yeah. So, they get a little bit more normal. So, but anyway. All right. Well, it has now been ten minutes since we said we were going to go. <laughs> <laughs> so, thank you guys for joining us. Thanks for being our guinea pigs for this. So, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And next time, I will let you know the drink ingredients beforehand. So yes. that way, if you guys want to craft the drink with us while we do the cocktail, you can definitely do that. Oh, Rosie's the popcorn person. <laughs> Gail doesn't have Patreon. Um, Gail, I can also... But you're a supporter on YouTube, right? So I will go ahead and put it in the YouTube also. And I can reach out to you on Facebook also. So I will put it out that way. Everybody gets the links to the Zoom. Because go check it out. It's a fun time. It's like continuing this, but yeah. every night. Yeah. So. All right. All right. Bye, guys. Have a good weekend.